there. I'm here with my man Dre, the name is Chase, and I'm interviewing him about stuff, what he likes and what he doesn't like in life. What's up? How you doing? I'm here to talk about what things what he doesn't like, so, but, so I'm gonna ask him a few questions of what he does like, Dre. Right? What is your favorite food? My favorite food? Oh man. I don't like a lot of outside food. I mean, mostly eat like my mom food, because she cooks a lot for me. My um, brother. Um, I like um, rice, beans, chicken. Either if it's regular chicken or hot chicken. Really what is your favorite dessert? Dessert? Um, dark chocolate. I don't eat a lot of ice cream, surprisingly. Um, I know that's a lot of people's favorite dessert, but it's just never been my thing. I don't know the whole concept of something that's cold and put it in my mouth. I don't know, it's never been my thing. Like a pasta, I could eat it, but not an ice cream. Where do you travel to? I travel? I don't travel a lot. Like, it's like I'm traveling like me and you walk and look downtown. So, like, the farthest place I've ever traveled to is like, North Carolina or um, Utah. Um, to be family in North Carolina to be a What is your favorite amusement park and ride? The only thing is, I've never been to I don't even know it's a fun place where, where there's a bunch of rides and games, and it, and some even have water parks inside too. Have you ever been to one? Uh, the, like this, the Six Flags kind of one? Yeah, kind of. Some of these parks are like that. Some are even indoor. I never knew that. Like, I guess you could say it's Six Flags for me. But Six Flags, is, I've only been it twice, and both of those times. I feel you, but um, what is your favorite thing to do outside your life? Outside, like work related, or just life? Uh, somewhere in between both. Well, what I do on my free time, if I'm not working, um, I usually um, write a lot, whether it's um, screenplays or stories. Or I'll write a lot of poetry in my free time too. That's it. To me it's very relaxing to see Or I'll read a lot of books. There's some days where I read and one day in real life. Mostly on Saturdays and some days where I read a lot. And I wouldn't even realize the day has been bad. Like I'll read for like six, eight, and then I'll get back to the end. Like I'll consider that for some people that tell me like really boring. I say to each of them, I think that is something that I enjoy and that I really like a lot of people. What stresses you out? What stresses me out? Tests. Like, I hate tests so much. Tests, exams. Um, oh, um, big crowds sometimes stress me out. And when I'm around like, a lot of people, I see them too. And I see them. Big areas, kind of like a little antsy, kind of getting a lot of anxiety. Um, sometimes I would get like a little bit of uh, people are in it. Um, but that's, that's something that's just, you know, like I said, that's what I do. I think I have this thing called sexy anxiety. Um, so like, I don't know the answer, but then later I think I'm on the page for doing this. If you had an arch enemy in one of your classes at one of your schools, middle or high? High school? No, high school was, it was cool for me. I didn't have any problems with anybody in high school. Middle school, I had a lot of problems with my There was just one kid, a uh, girl in particular, called her name, I can't say her name. And she would, um, you know, with TV, she'd like, 
I was had like I, I had a haircut like you when I was in like sixth to eighth grade and she called me like Baldy and she would say like little girl and she would always make fun of like my head shape and all like that. And I would just sit there and I would just be like, I hate this girl so much. And then like other people would do the same thing on the bus. And then that would be like and people would say that and that would be something I didn't want to do with like, I didn't like the fight, but I didn't like the fight. That was, you can say it in our channel. You can say it in our channel. Because my life used to be like, oh, I don't know. But uh, I can say it. Most of the time, I don't like the fight. You know, I just like, I don't know. I'll probably be bored for now. What is your favorite video game? Video game. Um, my favorite video game. Oh, I like sports. Um, I love the game 2K. Like football. I really love that football. Um, I get mad a lot when I play it because I get frustrated and I be like. Oh, and a new favorite game of mine. At first, I didn't like it. All my friends in school would always play it, and I'd be like, I didn't like it. And then as I got older, as, I, as the year went on, I started to like playing Smash Bros. I'm starting I'm starting to like it now. I'm not that good at it yet, but like, I feel like I'm getting better. You know, hold on, where's the kid? Whoever wants to play me in Smash. I have all confidence in that. I know that. I could be anybody. I know. I could be Reynel. I could be I could be Jose. I could be Brian. I could be anybody. I could be Sakara. Who knows? Yeah, I'm not a fan of Smash Bros. I used to be, but not anymore. Because what happened was I used to play it, but after a few years I stopped playing. But then when I Played again in my high school, which I'm finally free from, who take me off the most. I, I lost. Oh. Then, when I tried it again, lost twice. And I wasn't too happy about it either. <sighs> That's why I vowed to never play any type of Smash Bros. again. Not even try it a little bit? I suck. That was only two times, though. See, when I first played, I always lost. I still kind of still lost. I still lose a little bit. You know, sometimes I get lucky. Get somebody off the map, or like I might get somebody doing something. I don't know what it's called in particular when you like make them fly out the map or something. I don't know what it's called, but when you like make them look like a bomb or something, and it says like two out of three or one out of two, or something like that. Sometimes I get lucky. Like with uh, with uh, Jose, I think I beat him once. I think. I think. I don't know. You gotta look at the distance. Well, I made my point, but still, I suck never playing it again. Wait, so have you ever played like uh, Mortal Kombat? Uh, I did a couple of times, but it's kind of an, too mature for me. I'm not much of a fan of fighting against that from like what? Yeah, that's kind of their fatalities in that game. Not cutting people's heads off with their legs. And not to mention the death traps. <laughs> well, that game is crazy. I played it a couple of times, and I'm like, whoa. Mm. No. Crazy. Like some this dude that has like sticks or like his bones or like claws or something. And like he'll be cutting people's heads off with his claws like come out of this. He like will ring a little bit on his name. Karaka. Karaka, yeah. And like his thing will come out and he'll be like, yeah. Oh, he's he, he eating people and stuff. I'm like, oh, crazy. I almost like me, you know. Yeah, but Mortal Kombat, I don't play it a lot, but it's cool when I play it. Smash Bros. DK. And the new one is FIFA. I don't know. FIFA is a, 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 a football, or in the world they see football world. In America, it's soccer. Anyway, um, have you visited a museum before? Yeah. My favorite museum is that like the kids museum. And that which one would that be? That would be like the one headed for the 
guys we gotta wrap it up here but it's been a pleasure talking to my man Dre and we'll see you guys next time